Hey guys, it's Dan from Generation Productions here back again uh, to talk about some uh, more DIYs. And today uh, I'm doing the DIY about the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now the, the, these figures here, which I have all four of them, all four of the turtles. But the thing is, with all these four turtles, is that they are basically clip-on turtles. Now what I mean by clip-on turtles, I mean you can clip them onto your shirt or wherever and just clip them onto things. Maybe pencils or, or you know, bags or whatever. But the thing is, though, with these clip-on, these clip turtles, which were around from the 1990s, um, is that there's nothing, they don't come with weapons. So, um, I decided I might as well make some of my own little weapons for these guys. So, uh, for, Rafa for Raphael, we have the size. Now, how I made these... Uh, little size was <sighs> how I made this size was I used a, a toothpick and then from there I used a bit of blue tack and stuff like that and basically shaped uh, out of um, metal tin foil uh, into the shape of a sigh and so that's how we got the sigh um, then we come to Michelangelo and his nunchuck. So what I did was, again, broke two pieces of, um, toothpick and put them at two, I think, I think this one maybe even a matchstick, I think, uh, and put those two pieces on each end with, uh, the chain in the middle, which was like from like a key chain. Then we come to uh, Donatello's bow staff. Yeah, we go Donatello's bow staff. And basically, how I made this bow staff was actually from using a cotton, cotton wool, cotton swabs uh, stick. Which, oh, sorry about that, wool. Basically, the cotton wool, cotton wool swab things that would look like this. Basically, just recolored it, uh, took the swab pieces off, and there we go. We have a stick for Donatello. So, there we go. And then, we have these things. Now, I don't know what these things are. If people can leave a comment below and find out and tell me what it actually this... Uh, thing is, um, th th these sort of things here. Now, I think they're supposed to be some sort of uh, bolt, like a rivet bolt kind of thingy, but I don't know what they really are. Whoa. Ah. Sorry. Uh, some sort of river bolt thingy. And uh, I have no idea what the rivet bolt kind of thing. I have no idea what these are, so if people can let me know, that would be great. But these things go great to make little swords for the Leonardo and also what I think was good about cool about these things is that these things can even uh, fit in the hands of even uh, action figures so they kind of look like a sword for the action figures so that's uh, Leonardo Whoa, so, wait a minute ah, ah. There we go. So that they sort of, they can also fit in the hand like that for like an action figure as well. So I thought that was rather interesting. So if, so if people need to find out what these things are, they can probably use them as like a temporary swords for their Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles as well. And since they're made out of metal, uh, they won't break so easy as well, unlike some of the other pieces. <laughs> so that's the thing. Oh, by the way, that action figure there, that's the wacky action um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, Wacky Action Leonardo from 1990. Um, and basically, I think if uh, we wind him up here. There we go. His arm still works. 
so that's pretty cool. And uh, a lot of these Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I uh, started to sort of um, started stop uh, started stop collecting Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles now. So now I've been selling a lot of the stuff on eBay. Um, so hopefully, uh, there we go. I'm selling a lot of my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, figures and stuff on eBay. So. So if anyone's anyone's actually any interested in some stuff, there we go. People can go check that out as well. Okay, we'll catch you all later, people. Have a great day. God bless, and uh, keep, hope everyone has a great day. Okay, bye.